Hi everybody, welcome to Data Embassy. Today we're going to show you how to do sheet swap via parameter action. So here are the five steps for creating a dashboard for sheet swap via parameter action. So first we need to create a parameter with two values for two sheet swap. Well, if it's 10 sheet, then we need 10 values for the parameter. Then create a select filter for each sheet and then create a button sheet then drop the sheet into a container last set up parameter action here we have two sheet sheet one and sheet two there are two charts based uh, on two different data sources well they can be on the same data source of course so in this example we just have two data sources let's create a parameter first sheet select integer list one, two, sheet one, and sheet two. Okay, and then we need to create a sheet filter. So that is uh, sheet one, select filter. That's one, this equal to one. And we want to copy this and put this into the filter shell and then make it the uh, one into two. Then we need to go to this one and paste it and edit it to be sheet two select. That's one equals to two. The third is to create a button sheet on which we have two buttons. So for creating the button, we need to create a table with one column and two rows. Let's call control C, copy this and the paste control V paste this into the workbook now we have a data source with two values two rows that we can rename this as button and also this sheet as button let's extract it to be uniform let's design buttons we don't need the header fit the width take squares Make them big, really big, make a little wide, well, a little large and uh, a little colorful. And big. So we have the button. Now let's create the, the dashboard. Choose the size and put the button there i need this and add a container vertical container and drop the two sheets into it okay it seems we haven't add the filter into it yet make it true so one is showing and the other is hiding. Let's uh, hide the titles and make this uh, entire bit. Now let's set up the parameter action. Change parameter and select and uh, sheet button. Yeah, we do not need this because we're only going to select this on the button page. Uh, sheet swap action. Okay. Okay. Now let's click. Here we go. We just created a sheet swap via parameter action with buttons. Thanks for watching. See you next time.